So tell us and break down what's happening with Reverse Friendly Fire. Right, so we've been working on this for a while now. If you check out the video, uh, what happens when you uh, kill a friend uh, is you'll actually be sanctioned. So you'll get a warning for dealing damage to a friendly teammate, and then once you get sanctioned, any damage you do will be reversed onto you. Yeah, and there you can see clearly there's an indicator uh, that, you know, this is, uh, you're, you're now in the reverse friendly fire danger zone, and, yes. and then uh, your next skill will kill yourself. That'll last for the entirety of the match, and it was important to make sure that the lethality of friendly fire was still there, yeah. but we're making sure that it doesn't affect other people's games. Right, and I think it's important to note that this is uh, still just one iteration. It's, it's gonna hit the test server. We want you your feedback. We wanna test this over and over again to make sure we're getting it right. Right, we'll release it on the test servers first, get feedback. We're even playing with more down the line in terms of a forgive system as well. Yeah. Alex, uh, in terms of player behavior moving forward, we saw the player behavior sell. You know, what is the priorities of this cell and wh why are we putting an importance on toxicity and player behavior? With the game hitting now uh, 45 million unique players, uh, toxicity obviously and some of the negative behaviors are becoming uh, a more important topic that we all of us as players are actually experimenting and experiencing. So clearly uh, that cell starting with reverse friendly fire is going to be uh, handling that cancer that toxicity is and I do believe that's our intention that reverse friendly fire will have similar impact that when we introduced battle light uh, battle lights two years ago it's really like taking down toxicity as much as possible and at the same time rewarding positive behaviors in the game with other features that we can't say more for the moment we have a lot being worked on and and you know we're taking this subject very seriously